We're back, X and O's and Joe's, Coach Gene Clemens. This is the third part of our three-part series on two back gun runs, spreading them out. We gave you the zone in part one. If you haven't seen it, go check out part one. We gave you the counter, our gap scheme in part two. If you haven't seen it, go check out part two. This is our man scheme. We're coming downhill at you. You need to be ready for it. So our same three formations that we've been using the entire time because I wanted you to have consistency. I wanted you to be able to see that you can run all of these plays out of the exact same formations with both backs. Up here, we've got this all um, set up. We're going to run lead. Really simple. We're going to run lead, but you're looking at that, you're going, uh, you don't want to run lead into that because that's there. And yeah, it's, it's, it's messy, right? You want to run lead into this nice bubble. You want to have this guy just get his butt in there, him get his butt in there. Those guys block and double team that guy up to this dude if they can, so him to cut him off, him to go. Or you wanna have this guy be able to come up. You'd love for that to happen. Those five for those guy, five. This guy trying to come off edge and make something happen. But man, if he can get from there to there and make something happen, that says a lot about a downhill play. We're gonna, we're gonna say that he can't. He's gonna hold this guy on the outside. But we can't be sure of that. So we're bringing our three back through here leading. He's just going to open up to the side and take it just like that. Now, it's pretty simple to switch it and go from a 23 lead or a 25 lead to a 33 lead or a 35 lead. Just have this guy lead up, have that guy get the ball. It's pretty simple. Easy lead stuff. Plus, if you have him come this way, you can use that to read this guy. That sets up your RPO again. Because if that guy comes screaming hard and he's giving it, he can just walk up there and boom. Hit that backside slant right now. Over here, love it, right? You got to love it. Because two things are going to happen. We know this is going to come off the backside. We're going to run to the bubble. He's going to get his butt in. He's going to get his butt in. This guy is slanting in, so he's probably going to want to make sure he takes care of that guy because that guy can make the play. They're there or here. This guy is going to lead up through. He's down for that back. He's leading up through. He's coming and getting the ball. Or he's down. He leads up through. He comes and gets the ball. So that lead, very simple on that side. I like it a lot. It could be a 20, a 24 or a 26 lead or a 34, 36 lead pretty easily. But what happens, Coach Clemens, if that guy slants down? If he slants down, guess what? Wash him down. This guy goes outside and we keep this thing moving. This guy is the key. He's got to be able to get in here to block, make sure he occupies that outside backer. Over here in the go-go, it's pretty simple. One of these two dudes is going to lead. The other one's going to get the ball. The natural one, obviously, right here. Here, he's up on there. That guy's there to there. We're reading this backside guy. He leads through. He gets the ball. Right? You could also run it. Same action up top where this guy comes around and gets the ball, which allows that guy to lead up for the block. So the quarterback with that guy right there would just simply go here and hand it off that guy. This guy would just bubble around, come down. That gives him an opportunity to let this guy over on the side come through and lead. So you'd have your 20... 4, 26, or your 34, 36 lead, and that's how your quarterback could designate that. So you've got your lead out of three different. We're coming downhill. We're saying our guys are just going to run yours off of the line. You got to try to stop us. You can't get any better than that. So we gave you the zone in video one. 
we gave you the um the man I'm sorry the gap scheme in, in part two and now we just gave you a man scheme in part three this is by no means all of them so guess what you'll be probably seeing in the future more videos like this until then make sure you like this video and the other two make sure you subscribe to the channel let's get to 2000 let's get to 2000 before the year's over why not never hurt anybody until next time i'm coach gene clemens y'all have a fantastic day